Hey, welcome back. So my next video is my sale haul from Haley's Heavenly Scents. Um, this was a sale she had, I want to say it was like back in February, roughly. Um, so maybe it was like late February, early March. I don't remember exactly when. Um, but this is the third order I've ever placed with her. I believe it was three. And I've always ordered when she has a sale. Now her wax is always a really good price. Um, but then she always does these fantastic sales where you get a certain percentage off. Plus once you spend a certain amount you get free shipping. And then you always get freebies. And you are allowed to do, um, I believe, up to four of the items you order. You're allowed to do your, you can blend up to three different scents or something like that. Or you can do blending. I don't remember all the specific rules, but it's something like that. Because I do think she used to limit it to two items could be blended, but I think she changed it to four. So I'm going to jump in and show you the items that I got for free. Um, I got three bags of tarts and then four scent shots. So for the bags, um, I think it was if I spent $50, I got one bag of the of her Prim Words. And I'm sorry, there's going to be a good amount of crinkling in this. Um, which they look like this and they have different sayings on them and um, you get about I don't know 12 to 15 or something like that in here and so this one this is kind of out of my comfort zone and this is in cherry blossom and it is a little bit more perfumey than I had hoped I'll definitely try melting it but it does have kind of a strong perfumey scent and that's why I went ahead and got the prim words because that's kind of the smallest package with the least amount of wax in it so I figured if I wasn't if I ended up not liking it it wasn't going to be a lot of wax um, the next thing is I got two six packs these are again are the free items two six packs of her um, scallop tarts and these are a big size these are bigger than most of the scallop tarts you get from vendors oh this one smells great this is and this is one I blended did I blend this or does she have it on her scent list I can't remember but this is toasted marshmallow and fruit loops so toasted fruit loops and it smells fantastic just kind of a nice sweet creamy tart fruit loop scent this is really good Let's see where I can stick that and this next one I'm probably not going to take any out because it's pretty oily I don't know if you can see that but it's kind of seeping oils from the bottom so the labels even got messed up a little bit so I'm gonna have to put this in another bag or something but this is another one I blended it's whipped peaches and cream with Pizzelle and this is fantastic it is like a sweet and creamy creamy peach scent and I don't really pick up any of like the bakery note of the Pizzelle but it is so good it is really really good scent if you like peach scents this is probably something you would definitely like and you probably don't even need to mix it with the Pizzelle. You can probably just get her whipped peaches and cream. Because that is one of the scents on her scent list. This is not wanting to focus now. Anyhow. But that one is really good. So I'm going to lay that down right there. Like that. Um, for the scent shots that I got. And so the three bags. You could pick your scents. And you could also blend with them. Then the scent shots. Um, you could not pick. They were mystery. And so she just picked them and put them in. So this first one is Beach Cabana. I do not have the scent description for these. But this has kind of just a nice kind of ocean air, kind of beachy scent. There's a little bit of like a fruitiness to it. Um, but it smells really good. Oops. And I'm getting wax all over. I seem to make a mess when I do these videos. This is Chicks Dig It. And this kind of has an effervescent fizzy pop note. Maybe kind of like a lemon lime soda, but I don't know what else is in it. But that's really good. Um, this is Tropical Soda Pop. And this has a very tropical -y fruit scent, like pineapple and like orange and mango, papaya, those types of scents. Just a good tropical fruits. I don't really get like a fizzy note or anything, even though it has soda pop in it, but it's good. 
Red lipstick, I know this is a cherry scent. I don't know if there's anything else in it. But you pretty much just get like a sweet cherry. It's, it smells a little bit more complex than just cherry, so I know there's other stuff in it. I just don't know what, but it smells pretty good. I'm not the hugest cherry fan, but this one's not bad. Okay, so for the stuff I actually ordered, um, I will try and tell you too kind of what the prices are, at least the regular price on her website. Um, and then everything was 20% off on top of that. So um, the first thing here, this is a bag of her big roses. They look like this, and these are huge. So like one of these roses easily weighs probably about a, an ounce and a half. I'm going to weigh this for you guys so you can see. Yeah, 1.6 ounces. So these are huge. You get eight of them. The regular price on her website is um, $8. So then I got 20% off of that. And it is in pink sugar and sugar milk. This is a scent I love to melt at night when I'm going to sleep. Um, and so I figured I'd go ahead and get it in a good size. Now those roses are a little bit too big for me to melt them in my Glade warmer. So I will cut them in half if I'm going to do them in my Glade. But if I'm going to do it in my 24 watt hot plate, I'll put the whole thing in. So that's kind of how I do those because it is quite a bit of wax. It's, I feel like it's pretty much equivalent to like a scent shot. So, oops, and my stuff is going to fall over. Then I got a couple bags of her little teddy bears. So this is what they look like. Little teddy bear. You get eight of them in here. And this one is in, oops, and it's upside down. Pink watermelon punch. So that's pink sugar and watermelon punch. And that's good. You really get a lot of the watermelon. It's nice and sweet and juicy. And then I can get that pink sugar, so it kind of makes it a little bit of a pretty scent as well. That is really, really good. I'm not going to worry about trying to get that all put together. It'll take too much time. And then, oh, and I said you get eight. You actually get ten. Sorry, I lied. And these are five fifty. So here's another bag of the little teddy bears. There's ten in there. I straightened them out already too for easier storage. And this is in Birds of Paradise, which I think is going to be like a tropical fruity scent. And kind of feminine and pretty as well. It's kind of tropical fruits with florals. I think bird, isn't Birds of Paradise a, a plant or a flower? So it's very pretty. It's a, I've had this scent before from other vendors. This one's a little bit more perfumey and florally in the one, than the ones I've had from other vendors, but it's still really good. But for $5.50, you get 10 of those little teddy bears. And I may, like in my living room area, probably melt two of them, but in my bedroom I would do one. And then she also has snowflake shapes. Um, you get eight of them, and these are, I think, $5 regular price. And these are in Lemon Mint Leaf, if I can get it to focus, which I think is essentially a Bath and Body Works dupe. Oh, and that smells so good. It smells just like Lemon Mint Leaf. Such a great, fresh scent, and I think that's great for having for summer coming up. Ooh, and that white made my screen go really bright. Um, so I think that's great for summer. Kind of just have that fresh, it's not like peppermint, it's like a fresh mint leaf. Um, and then with that kind of tartness of a lemon, it's just a fantastic scent. And then another pack of the sun, uh, sunflowers, snowflakes, in elf sweat. And this is, although you see more vendors carry it during Christmas time, I feel like this is a year-round scent because it's really kind of like an effervescent lemon-lime scent. Kind of sweet lemon-lime soda pop type scent. And it's really good. I love the scent and I will melt it year round because it does not remind me of the holidays. I really enjoy it all the time. So I got a bag of that. Let me find a better place to store these. I always seem to run out of room. Let me move the scent shots. Okay. Then I wanted to check out these little shapes. These are the Mickey Mouse heads. So this is the first time I am getting these. And again, these were $5.50, and I think you get 10 of them roughly in here. So that's a pretty good size. I'd probably do two in my living room, one in my bedroom. And this is in Pink Blueberry Noel. 
So pink sugar, blueberry, and vanilla bean oil. And this is so good. It's sweet and fruity. It's a nice, rich blueberry. That's what I think I get first. And then the vanilla bean Noel adds that extra creamy sweetness to it. And I get some of the pink sugar. I love pink sugar with pretty much anything, but that is a great blend. I love that. Then I also got a couple bags in her little bunch shapes that she added. I think you get about 12 of them and they're $5.50 and it's various shapes in these little bunch shapes. Now I melted a couple of these ones already and there's different shapes in there and this is in pink sugar and blackberry or pink blackberry. So there's a couple missing from this. But this is a nice sweet blackberry scent with pink sugar. I don't get any floral notes. It's not like a blackberry jam where sometimes you pick up a floral note in the in the scent. I just get pink sugar and blackberry. Nice fruity blackberry, so it's fantastic. And the second bag of bunch shapes that I got is in this label looks a little different. It's more see-through. This is in blue cotton candy mango sorbet. Oh my gosh, I think this is like one of my new favorite scents. It's so fruity, like that blue cotton candy is like this bright fruity scent. And I'm loving mango, mango sorbet recently. And I'm finding that not a lot of vendors actually carry it. So it's kind of hard to get your hands on. Um, but luckily she does. But this scent is fantastic. This is definitely one I will continue to order again. I haven't melted it yet. I do let my Haley's Heavenly Scents cure. Um, even though it's paraffin wax and you're technically not supposed to have to let it cure but I find that if I let her sit for about a month I get like amazing throw out of it it's very rare that I've ever had a dud from any of her wax I usually get fantastic throw and it lasts a long time so um, and then the last five bags are in her Hello Kitty tarts and I actually found that these I think like for price per ounce are one of the best deals that she has you get eight of these Hello Kitty heads, and they each weigh over an ounce. Let's see, I'll weigh this little guy. And they're gonna vary a little bit from tart to tart. Um, they're one and a half ounces, and you get eight of them, and you pay $5.50 for the whole bag. So again, the sale price makes it even cheaper, um, but this first one here is in strawberry pancakes. I love my strawberry, and I thought it would be fantastic with pancakes. And it is. It's a nice, sweet strawberry, kind of like a strawberry jam. And I don't get a ton of the pancake scent right now. It kind of has a little bit of a, like, um, kind of a bakery note maybe. But I'm not picking up any, like, maple syrup or anything. So I don't know if that will come out when I melt it. Probably. I find, especially with paraffin wax, even though everything smells really strong right now and cold, I find that the scent itself tends to really change Sometimes when you warm it, especially like for some of the more subdued bakery scents, they tend to really come out once you warm um, warm them up. So here's another bag of the Hello Kitty tarts. So like just to weigh that bag, it weighs 11 ounces. And I paid less than $5.50 because of the sale. But if without the sale, you pay $5.50. So it's about $0.50 cents an ounce. So that's a fantastic deal. This is pink strawberry pizzelle. So pink sugar, strawberry, and pizzelle. Oh, and it basically smells like the same strawberry as a strawberry pancake, but there is that pancake is adding a note to that other one because this smells a little different. And then I get the pink sugar. But it's a sweet strawberry with that pink sugar. The pizzelle, I don't really pick up right now. When I melt it, I'll probably get maybe some kind of a bakery type note. So good. She has a really good strawberry if you have not tried it. The next bag of Hello Kitties is, I got a lot of strawberry, <laughs> um, strawberry pomegranate. I must have been in a strawberry mood when I placed this order. Oh, this is fantastic. A sweet jammy strawberry with that sweet, sweet pomegranate. Um, yeah, that you get, it's that sweet pomegranate that you can get from a lot of vendors. So this is a very sweet, fruity scent, oh, but really good. All of this stuff is going to be great for like summer. I got a lot of fruity scents. I'm going to move that out of the way. Give a little bit more room. 
this next one. There's more Hello Kitties. And this is something different, not strawberry, yay. It's sugar milk vanilla bean cookies. And I don't know if that's supposed to be vanilla bean Noel or just vanilla bean, and I don't know if there's a difference between the two, but I see some vendors that carry vanilla bean, and I do think it's different than vanilla bean Noel. Um, but I thought this sounded just like a nice, sweet bakery scent. And that's exactly what it is. You get kind of just like a nice, definitely that sugar milk note in there which you have to enjoy. And I get kind of like a sugar cookie and a little bit of like a vanilla. So it's kind of it's kind of light right now and cold, but with the scents that are in this, I would expect that. And I would hope that like, I think once I melt that one, I'm hoping that one comes off really strong once it's melted. I think just the type of scents that are in that tend to be on the lighter side when cold. And then the last bag here, is Farmer's Market Pizzelle. Um, and so I think Farmer's Market's supposed to be just kind of like all the fresh fruits you would get at a Farmer's Market then mixed with Pizzelle. Um, and this one is so good. You really get like a lot of, like it's a bright fruity scent, if that makes a difference. So there's some fruity scents that I think are heavier, like a lot of the pomegranates you smell that are really rich and sweet, they're a little bit heavier. This one is like a lot of bright fruits kind of like apples and oranges and sweet berries and all of that mixed together. It is so good. So that is this order. I wish you guys could all smell it with me. I'm super happy with it. Um, I know she's still making her way through all the sale orders, but one of the great things about Haley's Heavenly Scents, if you haven't tried her, is that she is open all the time. I don't, I don't think I've known of her to ever close down her website that I can recall since I've even started buying wax. So she's always open. Her turnaround time is always a lot longer when she does her sales because so many people place big orders. Um, so I think, you know, but she keeps like a status or progress up in her Facebook group where she'll list, okay, here's the orders that have shipped, here's what she's working on. So she's pretty good about communicating that. Um, and it will take two to three months, but that's pretty much the norm with custom orders or big sales and stuff, you know, now in the wax world. Um, but when she doesn't have a sale, her turnaround time is pretty quick and it runs just maybe a week or two. So once she gets through the sale, if you guys feel like ordering, usually she can turn around orders pretty quick. Um, she does do freebies and free shipping even when she's not running sales, but I don't recall exactly what it is. You don't get quite as much. I think once you spend $25, you get like a, a free six pack of scallops. And then I don't, I think you don't get free shipping until maybe you spend about $50 or something like that. And then at $50, I think you get two six packs of scallops. Um, so that's, I don't quote me on that. I think that's kind of roughly what she does. So it's still like an exceptional deal, even when she's not doing her sales. It's just that much better when she is. So if you haven't tried her, I highly recommend this vendor. I think there's tons and tons of set options. Um, really good throw and great just great price for her wax. So thanks everyone for watching. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye